to you, Kenny. I'm going to show you how to troubleshoot BMW um, electronic power steering. So these vehicles have electric motor that assists you when you turn the steering wheel. So if that steering wheel feels really heavy, you're going to get a warning on the instrument cluster, but also you're going to have an error code that points to what's going on. So with the Ucanic scanner, what you can do is select diagnostics from the home screen, select BMW and then your model, and then you come here and then go to control modules and we go to um, go to chassis and then go to electromechanical power steering. So well, this means there's electric motor, but there's also still a mechanical link to um, your steering rack. So that's why you can still turn the steering uh, the wheels, but it's really heavy when there is an issue with the electric motor. So you select that, and then read codes. That's the first thing that you can do. No full codes, but if there is an issue with the electric motor, you're gonna get a full code there. Um, and then once you fix that issue, you can clear that data. Uh, those four codes you can go to live data you can see you can see here the actual torque that's being output by that electric motor let's go back here uh, EPS pinion angle press OK as I'm moving the steering wheel here you get this the values there initialized status EPS initialized yes it tells us if it's initialized so like if you get a um, EPS module from the dealer it's not going to be initialized so that's that's why it's important and then active tests here you can reset the control module so if you have issues you can try that but if the codes return then you have an under underlying issue so that needs to be um, reset but just running reset on the control module is not going to hurt anything it might it's gonna erase the store data but that's that's okay and then get that at first we'll say carry it out but um, then uh, after a restart the steering wheel should be fine in this case you can see the steering wheel is still doing good and light so uh, just resetting the module is not going to cause any issues it could be it could help sometimes um, but not always if there is other issues going on anyway thank you for watching you can where you can be the mechanic